All right, so I uh, wanted to talk about uh, one of the main, <clears throat> one of the main, two main characters, but they're basically the same person. It's going to be Lilith and Isis. So the you have to understand that the the battle between the sexes has been going on since the beginning of time. This whole battle between man and woman and good and evil, this stuff has been going on since the beginning of time. But we're just going to focus on the battle between the sexes. But the battle between the sexes has been going on since this earth came into existence. And, you know, the best way to, to think about this is we all know the character of Lilith in the Bible. You know, she was the she was the person that hated all mankind. You know, she's she's symbolic of, of abortion, killing of children, and, and hating and, and wanting to destroy and see destruction of all mankind. And Isis and Lilith are, are the same people. It's just a different, you know, if you will, reincarnation of them. Because in here things work in what they call cycles. And this is where we get the terms like what comes around goes around. Or history is doomed to repeat itself. It's the same thing. It's because it's a cycle. It's the Ouroboros. Or the Ouroboros. It's the cycle. It is the beginning of time, the end of time. It comes and it goes. It's a cycle of how things work here. So, when we look at the battle between the sexes, you know, there's a story um, between Osiris in Egypt and Isis. And Osiris was cut into a bunch of pieces and sent down the river. And Isis found all, tried to find all the pieces to put him back together again because she wanted the power, but she was missing one piece. And you don't want to know what that piece was? It was his dick. It was his penis. And that's why you hear the term, or have maybe heard, of the golden penis of Osiris. It's because the penis is symbolic of power. Let me just sum up MGTOW and what your modern day woman is with this short summation. It all has to do with woman's jealousy over man. That is it. There's all of the many years of research done in the MGTOW community summed up in that short sentence. It's about woman's jealousy over man's power. Because it's a battle about power. Who has the most power? And so woman was jealous of man's power. So she wanted to destroy everything because she was jealous. That's why. That's all it is. That's all it is. That's why women act the way that they act today. It's because the same characters that have played out in history are the very same people. You know, we have there, there's, there are non-human entities that control and are here on this earth. If you think that it's just humans here doing all this stuff, then you're, you're, you're sadly mistaken. Because there, is a, there are non-human elements and entities trying to control humanity and control and, and gain power. ISIS is the entity that is in control of manipulating women. Because th these, these things work via controlling average people. Your average modern day woman. It's because these people are the same entities that have been in the same power battle as we see in modern day time with feminism using the same tools as they always have done and trying to achieve the very same objective that they've tried to achieve. It's nothing more than the battle of power between man's jealousy, woman's, woman's jealousy over man's power. 
And so this is why we see the feminists running around acting like a bunch of lunatics. Because these entities are, are possessing and manipulating the, so the society via implementing these tactics like feminism and all this stuff for a battle of power over man. That's all it is. That's all, that is all this is about. You know, it's funny. You know, certain content creators try to make this stuff more complicated than it needs to be. I mean, I guess they have good intention, but it, it, it overcomplicate things. I guess it's just because they don't know. But now you do. This whole battle between the sexes comes down to one thing. It's the, it's the woman's jealousy over man's power. You know, Lilith, that's why she went out and is synonymous with being the, the destroyer of, of wanting to see destruction and hatred for all mankind. Because she was just jealous of his fucking power. That's it. All that just because of power. Just because she was jealous that he had a freaking penis. That was it. And so all this feminism and all this modern day garbage is nothing more than, than this battle between the sexes. It's nothing more than woman's jealousy over man's power. Whether you want to equate that to the fact that man was, you know, uh, you know, s said to be and made in the image of the creator, I mean, it would make sense. But that's all this is about, is just a power battle. It's all about power. That's why ISIS... You know, she wanted that final piece, which was his dick. Because the dick represented power. The golden penis of Osiris. It's all it's about power. And I made a video talking about, you know, the, the sociopathic traits in your modern-day women in the modern-day dating scene. That video I did about all this, you know, how women are, uh, you know, the, 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 they exhibit these qualities of sociopathic traits and narcissism and, and all this other crap. It's because these entities like Isis and Lilith, who are basically the same person, are, are working through people to, to achieve a common goal. The, the, and that goal is the very same goal that they have been trying to achieve since the beginning of time. The battle of the sexes. And it's just using, it's, all it is is just using the people to be manipulated into a position to achieve the this agenda that these higher dimensional entities have. But they're just manipulating people here, your average person, to achieve that goal. And so when we look at the election, you know, Hillary Clinton was the, she was the, she was Lilith. She was the representation of Isis and Lilith. She was the woman, and that's why she screamed feminism and all this other crap. That's what it was all about. It's, it's the same battle. It's the battle of man and woman, good and evil. You know, and Lilith and Isis, they're on the side of evil because they're jealous of the power. And they want to get control and power. And so this whole, you know, that's why you see, this is why you see women today have all these traits of, of just, you know, we, you know, a lot of guys say, well, women are evil. Well, the, the, the battle is just of power, and, and the, the factions, these non-human factions, are working through these women to achieve that power. And so, yes, they're going to exhibit evil traits because the things that are controlling them are evil. And they're working for evil. And so that's why you see these things. So it's just history repeating itself. And that's why I made that, you know, I talk, I made that video about all those sociopathic traits. And, and so this is why you see the, these women, modern day dating scene. The, women, the reason why is simply because it's the battle of the sexes that have been going on since the beginning of time. And it all has to do with just the jealousy of women's power over men. And so what, what feminism has done what women's lib has done, what equality has done, all this garbage that these, these people have tried to sway and move the agenda of, of this thing 
is for the, the, the control over man, replacing woman as man because it's, it's ISIS against the, you know, the man. It's woman against you know, man for the power. It's all it is is power. And women are jealous because we have power. That's it. You know, that's just why you hear about all these terms. You know, like I said, it's, you know, we try to overcomplicate this too much, but, you know, we talk about how women like men that have a lot of money and they have a good career because those things represent power and they want power. It's not because they find you attractive because you have a good paying job just for the fact that you got a good paying job and money. It's because they want the power. And so when you see women today that hold that withhold sex and they manipulate and all this garbage, it's the battle of power. And so the only power that they have is to withhold sex. Because that's all they got. You know, that at least that's that's one of the tactics that they use because they, they want to have power over man. That's all this is about, guys is woman's battle of jealousy over man's power. And that shows itself, like I said, in the story between Osiris and Isis, of him, you know, she wanted his frickin' penis because she wanted the power. <laughs> that was it. And so that's why women want, you know, they're jealous of man having dicks. That's all it's about. You know, we, we overcomplicate it, but that's all it's about. And so what you see today is the very same agenda that is being played out, where... Women are being put in man's position, and women are trying to be are, are being portrayed in man's position. With the movies, women being put in all these action roles, and being portrayed as man, and having the government and all these other factions behind it. It's because they're working for these things, these entities, and and continuing the very same power battle. The very same agenda of, of woman trying to get control over man. And I think if you want to sum this up, you know, I made a video about how the woman of this world is the, is the woman, the devil of this world is a woman. It has to do with ISIS. It's ISIS because it's the power over man. It's the jealousy of man's power. Like I said, if you want to equate that to man being made in the image of the creator, it would be understandable to assume that's why. But but that's all it's about. It's just the same agenda being played out. And so whenever you see, you know, you know, women today, you know, with the modern day dating scene, you know, and, and the reason why things are so fucked up between the sexes is because of that very thing. It's 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 nothing more than the power about power, guys. It's all it's about. That's all it's about, and so women, the only they they try to get power over man. They they look the the your modern day woman is being, if you want to use the term possessed by ISIS, that would be the best way I could describe what we see with things like, you know, I said in my video about the sociopathic traits. You know, they're narcissistic and they want power and they want control and they abort their children and they act and run around like a bunch of lunatics. It has to do with that with that story. It has to do with ISIS, the woman trying to take control over man because of the power. And so, you know, to sum it up, that's all this is about. It's just a battle about power, and and the history repeats itself because the world runs in a cycle. And this is why your modern day media is is trying to put woman in position of man. And feminism trying to do all this stuff and, and call men misogynists is because the very same entity, ISIS, is trying to interact her agenda using the general masses to sway in her favor to complete her agenda like she's been trying to complete since the beginning of freaking time. And it's never worked. And so that's why there's this battle going on. And that's why women are so fucked up. That's why they're sociopathic, and that's why women, you know, we hear the term women are evil. It's because the very, the, the things that are, are manipulating things here, at least on the female side, is ISIS, and she works with evil because she has jealousy over man. And she hated all mankind because of that. And so that's the story. 
That's the whole thing. That's the whole bullcrap behind this whole battle between the sexes. Is is that is is this ISIS character trying to get control over man's power? This would explain why women seek. Like I said, this is why women like men with with a lot of money. You know, and and uh, and you know, guys talk about all this stuff. You know, it's like. Well, you got to be charismatic. You got to show confidence because it, it's symbolic of power. That's all it's about. And and it's not it's not because and it's not for the good either. It's for her. It, the only reason women go after men with a lot of money and all that kind of goodies and resources, it's not because they're it's not because they're predisposed to seek resources because of the cavemen times and all that garbage. It's because the, the this ISIS woman in this battle between the sexes is the battle for power over man. That's why women go after men with shit is because they want the power. And then they manipulate the man. You want to know why? <laughs> Just think about it, guys. Why, you know, all these high, really rich celebrities go through divorce and all this kind of shit, or the divorce rate is so high amongst them. And it's usually the woman trying... And she said, listen, it's so funny. It, 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 all, it's, it just all ties in. It's the same thing. You know, you, these 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 women go after really high paid celebrities and all these other people, and and they and then they and then once they get in there, they act real nice and then they, they completely raise hell and havoc. It's this ISIS woman. It's the same character playing out her agenda, and that same mentality is in the mentality of your modern day woman because history repeats itself. And so this is why they have such a high divorce rate because the woman, once she gets in there wants to manipulate to get the power. She's just she's a robber and she's a thief. And that mentality is the very same mentality of modern day women. That's why they exhibit sociopathic characters. That's all it's about. So wanted to bring that up. I'll I'll definitely make an, a continuation of this video because I didn't say everything I wanted to say on this. But it's important that we realize not to overcomplicate things and uh, just realize that this whole battle between the sexes, the feminism, the sociopathic traits, the women aborting their children, women and government specifically favoring women is because of this character Isis trying to get control over man's power. You know, that's why Hillary Clinton, the only thing she had going for her is the fact that she was a woman and that she was in for, for feminism and she was, and she supported it. It's because she, support, she, was, she was the representative of ISIS in this whole battle between the sexes. And that, that explains why women seek for money and power and fame and fortune and why they wear makeup to make themselves look prettier is so that when they finally get into a position of a lot of, with men with a lot of money, this is why women divorce men and, and they take all their shit. It's because of this ISIS woman. The mentality of this woman and the mentality and the battle between the sexes of woman's jealousy over man's power.